Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Welcome back to my youtube channel I'm Alfitri Molina In IAIM Bukit Tinggi Majoring in English Education Department In the 5th semester And today I will share to you One video How to use a paintbrush Before you watching this video Please like and subscribe And then comment this video Let's move to the video Okay guys Before we start the step one, let me introduce to you what is a paintbrush. A paintbrush is a tool found in image editing and paint programs that allows users to digitally paint on an image file. This feature enables users to make edits to an image, like giving a picture a mustache or create something new on a blank page. The image shows an example of what the paintbrush icon looks like in many programs. For the first step is opening paint. The first is open the start. Click the, wi the Windows logo in the bottom left corner of the screen. This is okay. And then type in paint. This will search your computer for the paint program. Paint. Open the paint. Okay, this is the paint. Uh, the step two is drawing and erasing. The first is review the toolbar. The toolbar, which is at the top of the paint window, is where you will find all of the options used to interact with the paint canvas. new and then open picture and choose the picture that you want to that you want to draw it or erasing I will choose this picture okay this is the that uh, this is the picture that I choose uh, and then for uh, uh, erasing the picture in the toolbar we know many application like this is eraser Click the eraser, the eraser part of the picture, and replace it with the background color. Okay. Uh, for example, I want to erase this, this hand, the minion's hands, like this. Okay. Uh, okay. This is to erase uh, the picture. And next, it's a brush drawing if you want to drawing the picture you can choose the pencil or fill with color and then or the text or brush this is a brush the type of brush is many this is like one like one calligraphy brush this is the calligraphy brush too. This is a air brush and then the oil oil brush, crayon, marker, natural pencil and watercolor brush. Uh, to use the brush, click and then choose one. Do you want do you want to use? Sample I'll use this like this up. And to use the pencil, click the pencil and like you want to make something in the picture. Okay. 
like that and if you want to insert some some line or something in this you can choose one of them the shapes the shapes what do you want sample i choose the this is shaped like this okay and uh, if you do not if you do not like the color you can choose one of the color that you want like this red orange yellow green turquoise indigo purple and extra and next to cut the pictures uh, the first is click the selection and in the selection is there are steps and option uh, this is you can see the first is read rectangular selection and the second is free from selection and the third is select all we uh, we we try to use rectangular selection we want to cut this picture okay enter uh, the pic the picture that we cut is loose we can make okay okay we can bring that picture that we cut to anywhere you can take this picture in this or back to his okay and or back to like this or like this that to use and uh, to do selection to crop okay in this in the paint brush we can use anything to to make that picture we want to edit beauty you can add grid liners to your paint project by click the view tab and then checking the grid liners box in this grid liners the okay to add a ruler interface to your paint canvas click the view tab and check the ruler box okay the rulers loose the grid loose if you want to give the grid liners, you can click grid liners in the view tools. Warnings for warnings in using paintbrush is also create a copy of a photo before editing it to avoid overwriting the photo with your paintings. The paint support has been disconnected by Microsoft, so you may need to download it from the Microsoft Store in the future version in Windows. Okay, I think that's all.